So you've just received your brand new Dixie Seating Company ready to assemble rocking chair and you're ready to put it together. Follow along with this video for an easy step-by-step -step guide to help you get your rocking chair ready to do some rocking. Step 1. Unpack all the items in your box. Lay all parts on the ground or table to ensure that you have all the pieces that you need for the full assembly process. The parts that are included are one chair back, one chair front, one seat, two side spindles, two rocking chair runners, one left arm, one right arm, and one hardware kit. The hardware kit includes four one and three quarter inch screws, four small nails, and one glue tube. These tools are not included, but you're gonna need them for the assembly. One rubber mallet or hammer with a soft cloth or rag. One Power Phillips head screwdriver and some sandpaper. Step two, pre-assemble all of the parts before using any glue. This is important, as some of the pieces may need to be lightly sanded to achieve the desired fit. Step three, Assembly of the chair back, side spindles, and chair seat. Lay the chair back, that's part A, flat on the ground or table surface with the holes facing up. Apply glue to the four bottom holes. Swirl the glue around in the hole while applying for the best coverage. Next, insert the side spindles, that's part D, into the two bottom holes. Then, insert the chair seat, that's part C, into the middle two holes and push parts completely into the holes. Step four, assembly of the chair front. Apply glue to all holes in the chair front, that's part B. Place the chair front onto side spindles and chair seat. Tap down with rubber mallet or hammer. If you're using a hammer, make sure to use a cloth to protect the product when you tap down. Step five, turn the chair on one side. Assembly of the rocking chair runners. Check the rocking chair runner parts to determine which end is the front of the runner and which end is the back. The front of the runner has the hole closest to the end of the piece and is squared off at the end. Apply glue to the holes, then place one rocking chair runner onto the chair front, then place the chair back. Next, use the hammer or mallet to drive a nail into the side of the rocking chair runner at each leg until the nail is flush with the surface. Repeat these steps with the second rocking chair runner. Step six, assembly of rocking chair arms. Set the chair upright. Apply glue to the hole in the chair back and into the large hole at the bottom of the chair arm. Place the arm in the chair back and then into the chair front. The arm should be fully inserted into the chair back. Repeat this step with the second chair arm. Once both arms are inserted into the back and front, one at a time, hold the chair arm down on the chair front and insert a screw into each arm. Make sure that the arms are pressed down tightly into the chair front before tightening your screws. It is important to not over tighten the screws.
Step 6. Place a screw into the pre-drilled hole in the chair back. Use your hand to pull the chair arm toward the chair back and tighten screw. Please note that the round dowel of the chair arm must be fully inserted into the chair back. Failure to fully insert this part of the piece may cause the rocking chair to lean back too far. Allow 8 to 10 hours for the glue to dry completely. We hope you enjoy your Dixie Seating Company ready to assemble rocking chair.